What's up, YouTube? My name is Jimmy. Um, this is my nephew's 1996 Jeep Cherokee. Uh, so my channel is going to consist of a bunch of really cheap built shit, uh, if that's what you want to call it. And um, right now, we just bought these all-terrains. They're 31 inch uh, tires for $200. So we're about to see what they look like on the Cherokee. This is my nephew's 1996 Jeep Cherokee. Bone stock, he got himself a damn unicorn. I mean, nothing, nothing done other than aftermarket headlights. That's literally the only aftermarket thing on this thing. Mine is not bone stock. I bought mine with a lift kit already, but then I added a 3.5 inch rough country lift kit. Uh, it was a budget build, but I didn't start doing this whole YouTube shit until now. And so my nephew's Jeep is gonna be kind of the beginning of the stuff that I'm going to be doing on my channel. So if you want to do things really, really cheap, and I'm not talking about like, this is not a $4,000 budget build. This is like a, I'm in high school and I make 250 bucks a week budget build. Now we bought these tires for $200 and they're pretty much brand new. So if you think $200 is too much, well then get out there and look for your own tires. You can still buy 31s 33s even 35s for like 150 bucks 100 150 bucks probably not in this good a condition but they're out there just look for it craigslist facebook marketplace five miles offer up all these places you can use to find really cheap stuff stuff that people just want out of their garage that's basically what this was the guy wanted 250 offered him 200 he just wanted them gone and now we have 31 inch tires now this is on stock suspension so we're probably gonna have some rubbing but as you can see i don't have a shop this is just my house this is my yard and i have tools and i don't have everything i just have enough to get little stuff like this done so we might pull out the grinder and do a little bit of grinding to trim a little bit to make these fit on a stock suspension go okay so some people struggle to put tires or wheels on their vehicles and i'm gonna show you a real easy way if you can have something to sit on if you're doing this in the middle of the highway well you can still sit on the ground if you don't mind getting your pants a little dirty one thing stronger than your arms are your legs so use them don't hurt yourself get the tire as close as you can as you can see i'm using my ankles to push the tire forward I'm not even using my arms, not using my back, using my legs. Once you find where the stud is, use your feet and crank them up. See? I, I don't even have to use my hands. So here it is, 31 inch tires, stock suspension. It does rub on the back side of there, but it doesn't rub over here. So, I mean, I guess you could say it is possible to fit 31s on stock suspension. I wouldn't recommend mud tires. Mine are 31s, but I actually noticed they're a little bit taller than these, and these are all terrains. But I mean, definitely an upgrade from these little bitty things. So, yeah. We're gonna take it for a drive, see how they do. He might have to go get them uh, balanced, but I think uh, I think it's definitely gonna help him a lot when it comes to off-roading. Anyway, $200 tire, wheel and tire upgrade. Um, again, super cheap. 